Hey y'all, and I am back for part two for how to create a digital vision board. There are five steps to this and I will go step by step and show you how to create one. Step number one, brainstorm about things you want to accomplish for the year. So I would write down big goals that I have for my life, things I want to start working on right now, be as specific as possible. Your goals can be in the area of lifestyle, career, finances, health, and wellness. Friends and family, love or personal growth, and faith. Step number two, choose images on the internet or a site like Pinterest that represent your goals. These should be actual pictures of what you want to achieve. So that next step would to be saying that to your desktop. Step number three, create a digital vision board online to make collage. So I use the site Be Funky, it's free, and I'll have a link below to that site. First, we need to go to the Be Funky website, which will be linked down below. Once you get there, you're going to click on the collage maker. I created a collage folder on my desktop so it'll be easier to find all the photos. So you just highlight them all, click open. From there, I'm gonna choose my layout. So there are several to choose from. Featured, there are four free there. Pinterest, there are a couple free there. Facebook, there are four free there. And a whole lot of grid. So I'm gonna choose from the grid collage. You can move these lines to fit your photos as you choose. Now I'm going to place my photos. You can also center your photos within the boxes. Now I am trying to find a pattern so my text can stick out. Finding a cute font that I want. I'm gonna title this collage 2018 goals. Now I'm gonna up the size, make it bigger. You see that line? That shows you if it's centered or not. Now I just feel like titling all of my photos. <laughs> so the top one is grad school. Next up is hair goals. Look how long her hair is, like, ugh. I just want that. Here I'm showing you the different fonts you can use. There's so many fonts. Um, you can change the color. You can use the eyedropper to choose colors from within the pictures. You can just do so much with that. Since the typewriter font isn't really sticking out like I want to, I changed it to a font that I was already using. Next title is social media. Upgrade style. And last but not least, it is fitness goals. Step number four. Save the final version of a digital vision board to your computer, make it your wallpaper so you can see it at all times. Save it to your smartphone, email it to your smartphone, save it to your photos, or save it as a um, background so you can see it at all times. So you can always keep in mind that you have goals that you want to achieve for that year. The most important and last step is to start thinking about your goals like in the morning time, right when you wake up, and evening time, right before you go to bed. So you can go to my Pinterest and there I will have um, a digital vision board. So those photos, I'm literally going to make a handmade vision board just so, I don't know, I just like making handmade things. So I'll have it digitally on my website, www.mrsmusicalville.com. And also I will have a handmade one that you will see in more music um, rehearsal. I still don't know what I'm gonna call those videos. 
uh, Music Mondays, Music Bill Mondays, I have no idea. Um, but you'll see that in the background so I can always keep it out so I can always look at the goals that I want to achieve. I hope you guys enjoy creating a digital vision board with me. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button, please, please, please. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!